Welcome to ATP Customs. And look who's coming home today. I was hoping, I wasn't sure if we could get this one today. It's going on the trailer now. Look at that. My 1954 Chevy panel truck is finally on the trailer. I did not expect it's going to be home so soon. And they're only five cars away from getting to our Belvedere and about three cars away from our 79 Mustang official pace car. Look at that. Got the barn doors. Love it. It's awesome. It's going home right now. So there we go. For so long I have wanted one of these. I actually wanted a Suburban as well. But the panel truck, I definitely wanted one. I'm going to pop a picture up of why I wanted one because I saw one online. That is not the exact build I'm going with. It just motivated me to want to get these. So I'll pop it up right now. And that is why I wanted a panel truck. That thing is just beautiful. So I want to do my own version of a panel truck now. Now, I'm not sure if it's 54. It has the 54 style grill in it. It's all cut up. That is not going to be cheap to replace. It's missing the hood. Has the headlight bezels. This fender's caved in. I guess it'll need a fender or two. That door is actually really good. I'm getting a little bit of rot there, but I'm okay with those kind of repairs. We're definitely getting better at that. This side's pretty good. And definitely repair all of this side. Fairly simple. Now, this side definitely got smoked. Somebody ran into this thing. I don't know if it was in the scrapyard when that happened. But the weird thing is, it actually didn't affect the doors they still fit fine you can see it really pushed it in here so there's definitely a lot of repairs to do on that panel oh well it's the only panel truck i've come across in my whole life it's got the wood floors still lots of crappy old parts in it that rad support is required the other one was cut up a little bit so thankfully it has that a little bit of rot down here I'm okay with that big dent floors are starting to rot see this inside kick panel is actually just starting down at the bottom here usually they're a lot worse when I see them you can see that one over there is definitely rotting so yeah it needs lots of rust repair and I don't care hey you still got the heater under there what else we got? Not a lot. It is just a shell. But it's an awesome shell. That fender is actually pretty good too. And it's got the full windshield, not the split window. So that's why I'm guessing it is a 54. Here, I'll uh, show you the numbers. Because I haven't had a chance to look this up. Oh, you can't see them very well. Anyway, I'll look those up tonight and we'll make sure this is a 54. So there you go, got my own panel truck. I know we're not making it a 4x4 like Gravedigger. We're going to go really classic, white walls, I want the chrome grill, all that kind of stuff. I'd like the deluxe package so that it has all the beautiful chrome trim along the fenders down here and stuff. I'm really happy it has the running boards too. Boy that's exciting. I can't stop staring at it. I, I'm just blown away I wanted a 54 only 54 I did not want any other year and there it was sitting in a scrapyard by itself nobody wanted it nobody wanted this truck 
So I took it. And we'll get to it. I don't know when it's going to be. We'll see how the season goes. we got a lot to do. And lots coming up, but we'll get to it. Between that and my 65 Suburban, that'll probably each be about a two-year build. But I have them. That's all that matters. Thank you for watching, and I hope you subscribe.